Good morning, folks. It's Diamond with the Oppenheimer Ranch Project, Magnetic Reversal News, and Shinrin Yoku. We are on the road in Gallup, New Mexico. It is 8 a.m. Mountain Time 2021 on December 4th, Saturday, December 4th. And we have some volcanic developments that I have to share with you before we get on the road and head down to Zuni. Semeru Volcano, just hours ago, high level eruption. Uh, to flight level 40,000, and this included some deadly pyroclastic flows. The massive eruption that occurred from the volcano this afternoon, there we see a picture of it. I'm going to blow that up for you in just a minute, but let's read the report because we do have loss of life from this volcano and pyroclastic flows. There was a massive eruption at 4.25 p.m. local time, produced large pyroclastic flows, which are hot avalanches of ash and rock. They can move as fast as several hundred miles an hour and be as hot as a thousand degrees. And these pyroclastic flows traveled down the southern slope as well as producing an ash column that rose 40,000 feet. Now, from the videos and photos circulating on social media, the pyroclastic flow reached farmland, but also inhabited areas. And it must be feared that it claimed victims and caused extensive damage. We'll have updates later tonight or tomorrow morning. Uh, when we get back into Colorado. But that is a big development from Semaru. A huge explosion that came into populated areas. You can see this moving towards, well, some very scared people. And there's another view of that. Massive eruption kills at least one and injures many, causing massive damage. That was the most recent update. And again, here's another picture. Let's open this image up so you get to take a look at that. Take a look. And we'll just blow that up. Look at the power of that. Now, this uh, is just one big pop, probably VEI-3, in just moments. So that is a huge amount of energy coming out of Semaru uh, just hours ago. Now, Grimm's Volton, the glacial flood peak is expected uh, tomorrow. And the meltwater is, well, a couple things happening at Grimm's Volton. The micro seismo has been ever increasing. And if you can see in the last 48 hours, a little curvature to the blue, it seems to be changing angle and maybe increasing ever more. So there has been a continuous uptick now for one, two, three, four, five, six, for 11 days since the beginning of the melt and now the flood. And if we come over to the live stream here at Daily Iceland, where 82 are watching, the last time we reported on the subsidence, it was down 25 meters. In just 24 hours, we're now down to 47 meters, an increase of 22 meters. So just since yesterday, the last time we did an update, the caldera, the glacier on the top of Grimsvoten, has melted an additional 60 plus feet. It has now dropped down over 160 feet, and it's getting steeper. And, well, we're just waiting for Grimsvoten to go boom. And so we're looking at some of the inflation uh, of the caldera itself and around the caldera. And we do have what appears to be inflation on the ground. And that means magma moving. So I was waiting for when seismicity began on the Vanta Yoko Glacier. Here is the approximate position of Grimsvolten Lake, which is now flowing out. And there is seismicity happening now. Some micro seismo and some larger approaching one magnitude. And that has been increasing for 24 hours hours of powers and we're waiting to see what happens in the next 24 hours which could be very critical to the eruption of Grimm's vault just to recap Semaru hot pyroclastic flows entering inhabited areas and covering farmland and injuring people and we're keeping a close eye on Semaru after the boom but also we have Grimm's Volton. We have the glacial outwash flood will be peaking tomorrow. And the drop down now is now increased to over 25 meters per day. And that is a boom to knowledge. Proper prior planning prevents piss poor performance. As we head out to a sacred festival, um, an annual festival at the Zuni Nation, there will be no photographs. There will be no videos. There will only be memories. We'll see you soon. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Share this with like-minded people. Be safe.